Well, after a night of worrying about the potential flooding of the Mississippi River, the city of Aiken announced today they are no longer currently under a state of emergency. The rising water from the Mississippi River fell below the initial prediction. Our Logan Gay has more on how the city of Aiken is recovering after this big scare. The city of Aiken can now breathe a sigh of relief. The Mississippi River, which was predicted to crest around 17 feet this morning, actually crested a few feet below the prediction. The Mississippi has crested at 13.5 um, or 14.5 and um, we're in the safe zone now. Although the Mississippi River did not crest, Aiken County still has to deal with the damages that were left after the massive storm from the weekend flooded several roadways. We have one road that was completely washed out and that was on County Road 4. And we have some um, local roads, uh, any gravel roads have some damage to them due to the water. The fear of a massive flood may seem overwhelming. Aiken County residents are well practiced on how to deal with natural disasters. I think they were well versed in the 2012 flood, so they knew what to anticipate, they knew what to expect. And state representatives stopped by the city today to help aid the community and help Aiken County recover. We did have a briefing today at the county courthouse. And we did have uh, Tina Smith, the lieutenant governor, was present. We had um, represent representatives from Nolan's office, Kobachar's office, and um, we had the county commissioners were there. And we also discussed um, the follow-up. The city is still asking for residents to continue to conserve water until further notice. In Aiken, Logan Gay, Lakeland News. And city officials still want to remind motorists to be extremely careful while driving through flooded areas. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.